This is my tired face. The first thing I do in the morning is my skincare. Even though I am supposedly an adult, I still get pimples. I put on primer, foundation, and concealer with my fingers and wash my hands a lot. Hello, hello, hello! Monday morning when all the possibilities are possible. They sure are. I do the rest of my makeup while I eat breakfast and listen to a podcast. This is my outfit. I don't put on lipstick in the morning because I have to wear a face mask on the subway. But the nose highlighter stays on surprisingly well. At work. I'm not filming my actual work because that involves a lot of 13 year olds. But uh, this is my desk. Then I went home. My boyfriend made garam masala for dinner, which was very nice. Then I tidied the kitchen. I decided it was time to rearrange the mugs for fall, cause yes, I do that every season. I got ready again to go to choir practice. This is what we're working on. I sing in the Oslo Philharmonic Choir and we're not allowed to have practices with everyone together so we're divided in two halves at the moment. This is the Oslo Concert Hall where we practice. Oslo was very pretty this evening. It had started to rain when the practice was finished. <laughs> I didn't have an umbrella. I washed my face and went to bed. Just kidding. I did some work in garage band until way after bedtime. Love that for me. Very tired and I still have that weird pimple. Hello internet! I just came home from work. It's Tuesday today and um, it was a good day. I went to buy some things that we needed, so we can do a very exciting haul if you're ready for that. Uh, this is my reusable shopping bag. Are you excited? I got cotton pads, cotton sticks, refill for the soap in the bathroom, neutral shampoo and conditioner because I'm getting new tattoos and I need this, a uh, cream thing because I'm getting tattoos. Cool story, bro. Avocado! Kiss. I wanted to eat avocado. I'm going to do that soon. Very hungry, very tired. Woohoo! <laughs> this birthday card for my brother, because it's his birthday today. Um, I have a thing for really ugly birthday cards. Um, it's not in focus. Boop, 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 boop. Here we go. Yeah, very ugly. Also, I got something in the mail today casually hiding my address. Um, this is a contract for me to sign, so I thought we should open it. This sequence has all the components of a good vlog. You need to have a hole, you need to have opening of mail. I'm nailing it. <laughs> okay, so this is my not publishing deal. It's just a deal and uh, it's, it's not a publishing deal, but uh, it's a deal and it's really cool. I just need to show you this little part here. This part says my name and then it says the author. I, I know it's not official, but uh, I'm going to write my name on that. So it feels pretty cool. Let's do the outfit thing as well, because I'm wearing clothes. This is a new sweater that I just bought. I really like it because it looks like dog tooth pattern print but if you look closely these are actually little dogs super cute and uh, that's it cool I got some new plants from a friend and it was about time I did some repotting. Then I went to have dinner with my family to celebrate my brother's birthday.
new angle just to make things <laughs> interesting. I just came home from work. Good day. I'm starting to learn the structures of all things like the timetable, when I'm supposed to be where and stuff. So that's good. Um, I just have one little rant. I don't care about being pretty. After work, I went to meet a designer friend who is going to make my wedding dress. Cause yes, I am getting married. I proposed to my boyfriend on our 10 year anniversary and uh, he said yes. We had a very good dress meeting and then some more people came and we had some pizza. Then a very fluffy dog came to the bar and then a guy was arrested across the street so it was a good night. On my way home I started thinking about the whole concept of filming my week. I wanted to make a vlog because I had never done it before but I think I also wanted to learn something from the process. The main lesson so far is how self-conscious it made me and how much I wanted to change that. I want to be able to think that my life is a story worth telling even if it's quite normal and I don't want to feel embarrassed about documenting everyday things. I don't know if that makes sense but I hope it does. I didn't actually film much from my day but after work I went out with some co-workers which was nice. It's good to get to know each other outside of work I think. I got home and uh, watched some Umbrella Academy while I waited for my boyfriend to come home as well. Saturday morning I put my hair in this awful ponytail and uh, went for a run. Then I made instant ramen with some kale and stuff. I have a friend who is like a ramen expert and he gets mad at me for calling this ramen but ramen is just noodle soup so you leave it alone. Then I went to this lovely studio to get some more ink. My total tattoo count is now 10 which is a good number but uh, there is still room for more. New angle again. Hey, it's uh, Saturday and I just came back from my tattoo appointment. It was a uh, very good. I'm very pleased. This is my new finger. <laughs> this is my engagement uh, ring tattoo. So it's a heart as you can see and then we have this fermata on top. And uh, the fermata is the thing that you put over your musical note if you want it to just be held for a uh, very long time so I thought it was cute to have it over the heart and it also looks cute um, and uh, yeah I'm very pleased with it and then we have uh, the ears I'll see if you can see it and this is the other very happy with those as well um, and then we have the last one which is uh, the biggest one and uh, that's the arm this still has the plastic on it, uh, so my, my skin is not that wrinkly. But, um, ooh, focus, focus, focus. And I think this also looks super cool. It just looks like it's supposed to be there in a way. Very happy. 10 out of 10 would recommend. So if you're in Oslo, you should uh, visit uh, Studio 4 or Studio Fire. Studio 4. Um, <laughs> I also uh, bought some things. Let's do a haul. <laughs> we love my hauls, they're the best. Okay, this is fun actually. I got like a bunch of these. I have been um, collecting these uh, hooks <laughs> for a while. Uh, actually since last summer because I was at the festival uh, Kadetten. This girl had this like vintage purse and then the whole strap was made out of these in uh, different sizes and I thought it was super cool uh, but I thought it was kind of embarrassing to go to the hardware store and, and buy like one and a half meter worth of these things so 
Uh, <laughs> I've just been buying a couple each time. Uh, but then I talked to someone who was like, don't you think it's weirder that you just come in and buy like three of these hooks because obviously they remember you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and now I'm like the cabin hook girl. So um, today I bought three of this and, and three of these, so six. And I think I maybe have enough now, so I will try and put it on my bag and we will see how it looks. Yay! I got three more pairs of these. I just really liked how this looked like one of the links from this necklace and I thought it would be cute to have it in my whole ear. I also bought some new headphones. Here they are. Uh, they are not ear pods. They are sound by Sweden. It's like soft. Ooh, yeah. I've been wanting some new earplugs to use when I run because I think it's so annoying to just have a lot of wire on me when I run. Um, and that was a good time because I can't wear my big headphones while my tattoos are healing. But I still want to listen to music and uh, I have to work on my EP. So I will wear these for a bit. But now I'm going to eat my sushi. I was home alone in the evening, which was kind of nice. I am actually a big introvert and uh, I do need my alone time. And when I'm alone On Sunday, I just worked on my EP the whole day. One of the themes on the EP is this idea that your life is a story worth telling. And I like how this vlogging experience also made me think of that. While I was editing this vlog, I got the idea of using some of these clips as a video for one of the songs on the EP. And I think it will be cool, kind of like exploring this theme from different angles. Okay, then I made spaghetti with lots of oregano. And in the evening, I went for a walk with a friend. And that was my week. Thanks for hanging out with me. I hope you got something out of it. Remember to subscribe if you did, if you haven't already. I hope you'll have a really nice rest of your day, and I will see you very soon. Bye!